Hello, my name is Alan and I am the owner of GoThrough. In this uh, video, we're going to talk about how to create a blue line on Google Street View. Now, before actually creating the line, uh, blue line, we're going to have to understand that Google has two pipelines, basically two type of way of ingesting images on their system. One is by uploading uh, individual uh, panoramas to them. And the second is by uploading 360 videos to them. Now, go through um, supports both pipelines, and we support it in such a way that it doesn't matter how you what you upload to Google go through. Like you can upload individual images, and you can uh, process a video, a 360 video video via the uh, Street Builder. In go through, they will end up as individual panoramas. And then in go through, you have the option to select if you want to create to a blue line via the, the individual panorama pipeline or via the 360 video. Because go through takes the images, the panoramas, and puts them together into a video and then sends that to Google as a video. So in this particular uh, tutorial, that's what we're going to explore, creating a blue line from individual panoramas where go through is creating a video and uploads that video to Google. Now, why we want to do that? Because that's giving us some uh, benefits and maybe you want those. So let's go ahead and what we're going to do is create a new listing and uh, we're going to select the blue line and click start and we're going to put the address like we need to put an address that's close to where the listing uh, is going to be uh, the blue line is going to be and let's say that's our street and hit create and just upload your panoramas moderate the tour uh, and then you will end up here, uh, like probably having something similar with this. Uh, now, the same place you end up if you are using the Street Builder, um, go to Street Builder, where you have the video sliced into frames, and then the images are uploaded to go through. Now, if you haven't seen, if you are interested in that um, process, you should watch the video where I'm exploring how to use uh, the Street Builder application. So once the panorama are uploaded, um, we have to be aware that Google has a few uh, limits. And one of them is you have to have at least 25 panoramas to get the blue line on Google. Second, the distance between, between panoramas needs to be between 3 and 5 meters. So once everything is in go through, all you have to do is just click Google and then you publish the tour to Google. Um, and then in the background, go through will create a 360 video and uh, we will uh, upload that 360 video to Google. Now let's go ahead and explore this particular uh, blue line. Um, and let's see if we can go like from the air. The blue line is somewhere in here. I'm just gonna take the yellow man and click and we're gonna end up in the blue line. Now, one advantage of uploading, of creating a blue line via the uh, via video process is that you can jump over multiple panoramas. Oops, and end up in a Google tour. Okay. So, you can jump over multiple panoramas. Now, an ad another advantage is Google will find all the license plates, places and all the faces in 
your panoramas and they will blur them automatically for you. So if you have, let's say, a big street, lots of people, lots of cars, this should be the way you would want your panoramas up on, on Google because uh, if you upload via, via the first pipeline, the individual panoramas, then the job of blurring the faces and places, places will be yours. Oh, if you just take a look, yeah, everything uh, is blurred. So, but having a blue line created via the uh, this process, the video process, it has also some um, drawbacks. Basically, because this was created as a sequence uh, in Google, if you want, if you have a business on the side you cannot link that business to this tour. Um, what, um, uh, be, and the, the advantage of uploading with uh, the first pipeline via the uh, individual panoramas is that those are individual panoramas and you can connect the business with the blue line and you can explore uh, like we have a video where i'm exploring uh, where i'm explaining how actually to create that link between uh two different tools published uh within your account so this is how you create a blue line via uh, the 360 video pipeline